Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone to Marble Racing League's latest series, Dino Marble Madness. Sixteen Dino Marbles enter, but only one will be crowned champion. Two marbles from each quarter final group of four advance to the next round. And they're all racing towards that championship cup. Let's meet our contestants. Quarterfinal one has Ankylosaurus, Triceratops, Dimetrodon, and Pachycephalosaurus. Quarterfinal two has T-Rex, Allosaurus, Compsognathus, and Iguanodon. On the other side of the fence is Lepluridon, Velociraptor, Crithosaurus, and Stega, Stega, Stegosaurus! And finally in group four, Parasaurolophus, Carnotaurus, Dilophosaurus, and Pteranodon. Who do you think is gonna win the cup? Comment below. All right, let's get started off with quarterfinal number one. Let's meet our competitors. We have Andrew the Ankylosaurus, a former Pangean golf champ. You have Trillian the Triceratops, a five-time triple horn champion. Next, we have Dimitri the Diametrodon. He's never won a single race, but he's been trying his best ever since he came out of his egg. We have Patricia the Pachycephalosaurus, Born in the swamps of the Cretaceous period, she rose out of obscurity to defeats of athletic achievement in the boxing rings, but it's not her left or her right that you should fear, but her 10-inch thick skull used for ramming. Let's go down to the race course. Ready, set, roll! And we're off! Dimitri the Dimetrodon in blue sailing out to an early lead. Dimetrodon and Ankylosaurus breaking out with Triceratops and Pachycephalosaurus trailing. Dimetrodon breaking out a substantial lead with Pachycephalosaurus challenging Triceratops for second. Oh my goodness, Pachycephalosaurus ramming into the clothesbin and being sent flying. Triceratops avoiding all the obstacles, horns in on second place. Pachycephalosaurus trying to get back into it and no sign still of Ankylosaurus. Onto the wobble board, Dimitridon maintaining his lead with Triceratops a close second. Pachycephalosaurus getting on the board in third. Who's that in fourth? It's Andrew the Ankylosaurus trying to get back into it. Give him some support, folks. Dimitri and Trillian in the rotator just trying to close this one out now, both with what should be insurmountable leads. Trillian the Triceratops out first, but who will be second? Oh, it's Andrew the Ankylosaurus. What an amazing comeback. Really in the Triceratops, closing out the race on the last ramp. Ankylosaurus now also on the last ramp. Packy bumps Andrew, Andrew swooping in for the lead. He's across the line. And Trillian also across the line for the second qualifying spot. Nothing left now for Packy Cephalosaurus. Ah, and there finally is Dimitri the Dimetrodon. Us with Andrew the Ankylosaurus and Truly in the Triceratops, moving on to our second round. Welcome back to the Marble Racing League. This is a remastered version of our second quarterfinal, so enjoy! Let's check out the starting grid. In lane 1, as the red-orange marble is Tyrannosaurus Rex. In lane 2, I see the light green marble of Apatosaurus from the Jurassic period. In lane three, the two-time winner, Compsognathus, as the clear marble, our favorite for the day. And in lane four, I see brown marble, Iguanodon, a late entry into the contest. Who do you think will win? Comment below. The marbles are getting set in their marks. Let's get down to the track. Ready, set, roar. And there goes Compsognathus out to an early lead. T-Rex and Iguanodon in hot pursuit with Apatosaurus lagging behind. Oh, Compi went so fast he got stuck getting off the last board, now slipping to fourth. Apatosaurus moving into third. Down into the rotator, Iguanodon and T-Rex just trying to close this one out with two boards to go. Iguanodon bringing his A-game today grabs an insurmountable lead. Oh wow, who will it be for second? The T-Rex is attacking, looking to finish this off. Boom! T-Rex and Iguanodon through to the next round. 
Welcome back to our latest quarterfinal of Dino Marble Madness. In lane one, racing in orange is Lepluridon, the harbinger of doom. In lane two, in red is Velociraptor, a future Hall of Famer on the marble circuit. In lane three, a newcomer to the circuit is Corythosaurus in blue. And in lane four, the local fan favorite Stega, Stega, Stegosaurus in yellow. Who do you think will win? Comment below. Let's get down to the starting gate. Ready, set, roar! Stegosaurus throws the hammer down out of the gate. Corythosaurus and Lepluridon make it through the first turn unscathed, but Stegosaurus enters the rejectors well out in front. Whoa, Lepluridon just got hit so hard it probably hurt his whole family. Flipping the third. Everyone moving through the wobble board, Velociraptor a distant fourth. Stegosaurus through the rotator, but wait, is stuck in the maze. Oh no, there's nothing wrong with that marble, except it's on fire. Leo and Cory out of the rotator. Leo heading straight for Stegosaurus. Crash, everyone's on the move. This is gonna be a finish. Whoa, Stegosaurus powers over the first ramp and across the finish line. Now Velociraptor in the mix. Can she pull off the upset to advance? Leo defending, defending, defending and sneaks through. Well, if you don't like that finish, you don't like marble racing. Stegosaurus and Lepluridon advancing to our semi-final. Welcome back everyone to the last quarterfinal of Dino Marble Madness. In lane one we see Parasaurolophus in red, easy to identify with that big crest on his head. In lane two is our villain in black, Carnotosaurus with two horns on top of his head, keeping me up at night. In lane three is our only Jurassic period dinosaur in Dilophosaurus. If she wins, get ready to see an impressive dance display. In lane four is Pterodon in white, not technically a dinosaur, but one of the fastest marble racers you'll ever see. Who do you think will win? Put your choice in the comments below. Let's get down to the starting gate. Ready, set, roar! Carnotosaurus bullying himself to the front of the pack and out the first turn. It's a barn burner! Carnotosaurus and Pterodon flying out there, folks! Oh, Dilophosaurus has fluttered out! Carnotosaurus is stuck on the edge of the Ankylosaurus obstacle! This could be devastating! He needs a bump! Won't be Pterodon sweeping past. Smooth sailing here for Pterodon. What? Do you believe in miracles? Parasaurolop is soaring over the top to take first. Pterodon holding on for second. What a finish! What an upset of Carnotaurus! That's the last of our quarterfinals, folks. On to the semis and remember to subscribe. Welcome, 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 Marble Racers. It's the first Dino Marble Racing League semifinal. If you didn't watch the quarterfinal, stop now and follow the links. In lane one is our quarterfinal winner, Parasaurolophus. In lane two in red is T-Rex. The semifinals did need more teeth. In lane three is tried and true Triceratops. And last but not least, Ankylosaurus looking for his first ever tournament win. Who do you think will win? Put your choice in the comments below. Let's get down to the new starting gate. Yep, we invested a couple dollars. Okay, ready, set, roar. It's close out of the gate. Into the new bouncy ball arena. Triceratops out front. Whoa, crash! Parasaurolophus has her bell rung and installed. Is this it for her? No, saved by Ankylosaurus.
Triceratops and T-Rex now in the roller, looking like the party's over for the rest of the field. A slave to death, or a slave to sweat. A slave to death, or a slave to sweat. A slave to death, or a slave to sweat. Boom! T-Rex through to the final. Final needs teeth too. Okay, who's next? Triceratops and Parasaurolophus is with the last ditch effort, but no! Triceratops across the line. T Rex and Triceratops across to the final. Welcome, Marble Racers, to the last Dino Marble Racing League semifinal. If you didn't watch the quarterfinals or the other semifinals, stop now and follow the links below before you spoil the results. Let's see our semi-final two racers. In lane one in orange is Lepluridon, a surprise semi-finalist. And in lane two, Parasaurolophus, who crashed through the competitors in her quarterfinal. Lane three, it is Pterodon. And finally in lane four is Stega, Stega, Stegosaurus, rounding out our semi-final. Who do you think will win? Put your choice in the comments below. Let's get down to the new starting gate. Ready, set, roar! The Flirton breaking out in an early lead into the elastic. You can put Leo at the top of the leaderboard! Parasaurolophus and Pterodon closing in. Whoa! Stegosaurus got his bell rung with that hit. Hey, come on, get that hand out of the way. Yeesh, I think Leo got stuck on a jewel and got dropped to third, but who can tell with that hand? Yes, Parasaurolophus and Pterodon into the rotator. Leo fighting to get back into it. Here's Stegosaurus late to the party. Holy cow, orange and red racing to the finish. First to the, to the finish advance. A slave to death, or a slave to sweat. Whoa, look at that! Stegosaurus put baby in the corner! It's gonna be an upset unless Parasaurolophus can pull out a Houdini and get unstuck. <laughs> she just has to hope that everyone else got stuck or she'll be bumped. Here's Stegosaurus again. No, no bump. Looks like Stegosaurus is going to move on. What an upset. A little showboating there by Stegosaurus at the finish line. Lepluridon and Stegosaurus advancing to our final. Welcome, Marble Racers, to our Dino Marble Racing finale. We have our final four. We have a new robot obstacle, and we have a great audience. You guys, the audience, thank you all for your support. Let's meet our finalists. In lane one is Lepluridon, a massive marine creature who continues to surprise. In lane two is the king himself, T-Rex, looking to be the king of all marble racing. In lane three, Triceratops in clear red, she's ready for another championship. And in lane four, a very lucky Stegosaurus. Nothing went right for him in the si semi-final, but you just need to be lucky. You don't need to be good. Who do you think will win? Put your choice in the comments below. Let's get down to the starting line. Ready, set, roar! They're all even out of the starting gate. T-Rex taking a small lead into the turn, but they're all bunched up so far. Everyone is fighting for position. These truly are the best racers on the circuit, folks. It's too close to call. Everyone's crashing. It's getting ugly out there. This isn't a race. It's a showdown. Lepluridon and Triceratops eking out some separation. Down into the rotator. It's a two dino race. Lepluridon is out, but caught. Oh no. The win is there for the taking. Everyone is out now by Triceratops blasting by everyone. But away we go, final board. 
Yes! It's gonna be close! Triceratops holding on for the win! T-Rex sneaking through in second, Lepluridon in third, Stegosaurus nowhere to be found. Wow, everyone, just wow, that race had a little bit of everything. Our final standings, Triceratops is the winner, congrats! T-Rex pulled off second place, Lepluridon had it, had the win and let it slip through his fins. And Stegosaurus again having trouble on the course, but this time no lucky break. Thanks everyone for watching. We do have some more races planned, so please subscribe and enjoy.